we need to look at the, the speed of CA prim, uh, Alexander II, not CA premium. Yeah, the whole idea, we want a situation whereby once we deploy this software, people are aware about the speed in terms of signing the invoice. So that once it's agreed, we don't have a situation where people start to say, you know, you see, it is, the signing is taking too much time. So you will need to have a look at it and examine it. Then uh, you can advise which software you want to pick, whether you want to continue with the uh, uh, CA Premier Superjet, which takes about two minutes to sign in, or the other one takes a maximum of 25 seconds. Okay? CA Premier, sorry, takes two seconds. Wow. Alexander 2 crowd takes a, a maximum of 25 seconds. Sometimes it comes back to something like 18 seconds. So you have to make the right choice at the beginning because we may not have an opportunity to change the software once it is installed. So make a decision now. Yeah, now let's examine it, Alexander 2 the speed against the smart invoice. Okay, let me log in here without wasting our time. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to log in now. This is the crowd, Alexander two. Let's see what we can do, right? I think you are familiar with this. I'm logging in, I'm in the system now. So now let's create the invoice here. Yeah, this is a crowd Alexander 2, whereby you can use it in a different places. So here you select a custom. Let me say, suppose the customer is like this. So, okay. <clears throat> I've selected the customer there. Yeah. So you come here, you select the you select the tax name with the document type here. Oh, sorry. The yeah, document type here, which is that one here. As you can see, the change here is writing now as a, a reverse or credit note. It should be is represented by R. Okay. So I'll say it up here. Yeah. So those are the changes which are there. Instead of a zero for a tax invoice, is now S. Instead of okay. Uh, one for reverse or credit note is now R, okay? So as usual here, those who are using crowd are uh, familiar with here, here, you type in the product which you want. So let's see, say I want water, okay? I'll type in water here, then it will pop up here, all right? So you just select here like this, then tab, Always use a tab, okay? I'll put maybe one here, okay? Yeah, right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, now here, suppose I want to sell also cement. I will say cement, okay? Yeah, cement, remember this one is MTV, those who are selling, uh, using it B, okay? So I'll do it like this. Okay, so let's say maybe cement and the sugar, they use it, rate B. So let me put maybe quantity two, right? Yeah, as you can see here, it has also put RRP, okay? Yeah, okay. I'm not concerned with the capturing. I'm only concerned with the sending data to ZRI. So our invoice number is it? Six that one, although this one it means nothing. Take it from me, this means nothing. The invoice number comes from the authority ZRA. That's the invoice number which you have to use. So I'll add it here. Okay, this is just for the purpose of sending that. Okay, yeah, so it's added here. Our concern here is this sending the data here. Okay, let me show you. Yeah, so six that one. You see, between this message here, please, please listen very carefully. You see, between this message 
and the time when you will be informed to say the invoice is signed. That's where the bone of consent is now. Let's now time it up from this point up to the time when we will see that the invoice is signed. We need to count the seconds. This is what I'm talking about. And this is where you are going, you are required to make a proper decision. Okay? So here I will say no. Then we start counting the seconds up to the time when we will receive an invoice. It will go because at this point, the data is going to the server, which is in California. Okay? Oh, not California, Florida, sorry, not uh, in America. Then it will come back and go to ZRA and bring us an invoice. And then we save back to Florida. Then we'll have the tax invoice. So we start counting. Okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Okay? You have seen what I mean? So it's approximately 25 seconds the invoice comes back. Although I was just trying to be fast enough so that he, uh, but he, the approximate is it? 25 seconds the invoice comes back. As you can see, it has come back. It has given you what is the invoice number? 225 here. Okay? So this is the time which is crucial for you. And this is where you are going to make a decision. So I'll say, okay, the invoice is back now. This is what I wanted you to see. Okay? The rest are straightforward. You can see, no, no, no need. You just see get the invoice here and print it, okay? Yeah, so you have seen where the 25 seconds is coming from. So depending, according to your business, okay? If your business makes you require uh, generating maybe <clears throat> four invoices per minute, then it's either you revert back to CA premium. If it's okay, you can allow two invoices per minute. Then this one still remains an option. You can continue using this. You can see it's assigned everything is there. Remember I told you that it's 225, the invoice number. Where it's written, receipt number, that's your invoice number. Okay? All right. So this is very important because ZRA will be looking at this. This is the invoice number which they have given you for this document. Everything is done. RRP, everything is done. Okay? So now you can print that thing, yeah, without problems. Okay? So um, let me see if I can also uh, verify this invoice by going on the internet. Okay? I'm trying to go there on the internet here. Okay, then, okay, let's verify together. I don't want a situation to say no. Uh, actually, uh, the invoices are not going to the server, no. Yeah, once we give the product ourselves is certified. There is nothing like no this. That's why we always make sure that the, the currency they are actually given the right information from the beginning. Yeah. So that no one can complain to say, no, this was not happening. Okay. So now, <clears throat> okay. So now, let's see, see 
whether that invoice has gone to the server. Okay. Yeah. So there we are. We are on the server. Let I report. Remember, I said it was 225. So what we'll do here, we'll select 27 here. Yeah? Is it? Yeah, then search. Okay. So this is the invoice which was there. You see? So it has given us, it says here a cell. Invoice number 225. Remember, I showed you there to say it's actually 225. There is the invoice. I don't know if you are seeing or you are seeing what I'm seeing. I hope you are seeing. This is what we are uh, seeing there. Remember, I told you cement, there were two bags there. Okay? There. And this is the taxi. And the other one was the package to what? It is the, this. Okay? And the, the total was that. So, okay. Yeah. So, everything is there. So, when you add, there is a before VAT amount is there. So, when you add that, it gives you uh, the total which you have there, which is okay. So this is the way how it is seen works, okay? So you have seen the invoice. If you want, you can even print this one. If that's what you opt, the choice is yours. I've shown you how this thing works, yeah? We don't want a situation where by at the end of the day, one comes and say, no, we are not shown how the invoice sits on the server. This is my TPN number here, okay? So now, from here, let me take you back to the server here. I'm um, more interested with the taxes, please. Check if already B is 49.66, and the other one is 16.55. So let's see, see if I can go back there and get the uh verify the taxes you can see 16.55 and 49.53 everything is okay yeah this is the amount before vat the vat is there as well mm -hmm. so i've shown you this so now um okay let's move now the other thing which i needed to do to try and uh, see if I can um, show you the other one. Okay, while well, we are still here, let me see if I can. Uh, oh. Okay, share. Okay, all right. Yeah, take you here. Yeah, so that we still have a new share here. Now, let's examine also CA, CA premium so that you understand what I'm talking, what I was talking about. Let's see if it is possible to do that. Let me see if it is possible to do that. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'll say, okay. So, okay. Then, yeah, so we are now with the in the CA Premier. This is a new share there. Now let's examine the other software, which is cloudy. We saw that it was taking how many minutes? How many seconds? Not minutes, seconds. You see, approximately twenty-five or twenty-four. Okay. What about the CA Premier, which we call Superjet? Okay. Let's see. We shall see together here. <clears throat> So that as we are dealing with these things, everyone is clear. We don't want a situation where after installation, uh, other people have some other ideas. No, yeah. We do, may not have time to uh, change things, you know. Yeah, we are showing you everything in advance. So this is the invoicing which we are doing. So let's do now. Okay, maybe city market bakery. And uh, so, Okay, as you can see, I'm selecting the tax invoice, which is the SC, all right? Yeah, so I'm here. So what I will do now, I will select the oil here and say maybe here too. Okay, all right. Then now, what else should I select? Okay, I can select maybe cement as well here. Okay, this time around, let's say one, okay? 
now here let me select you also um some bands okay okay maybe three here mm -hmm. okay done so uh reference number 25 80 okay you can write that reference number for 25 80 because when we go to the other side we'll buy it so i'll say add okay so now let's see what happens here this is the message which i was talking about now let's see between this message and the time when we receive the invoice how many seconds is it going to take okay i'm starting now get ready people start counting the second this is ca premier not crowd local area network i'm now starting go one okay you see it takes only one second to sign this one this is the reason why i'm saying for those who are running maybe supermarket this is what you need you will not have you there will be no way people are going to be queuing because signing takes only one second for a maximum of two seconds as you can see the invoice comes out all right yeah i can even come here and print it there it is okay Mm -hmm. there is the invoice now right and that was 25 with the reference number 25 8 okay here it has given the, remember the other one was 225 now it has given us 226 the zla one so this is what we have here so let me see if i can go on the zla site okay okay new share yeah where is uh, this okay mm -hmm. and then i do this let me come here right i just want to make sure that he, i've shown you everything because i may not have the luxury of time to go through this again mm -hmm. this is your city market bakery remember the other one was 225 the new one which we have created is this one so you just click here to see the invoice. So this is the invoice. All the taxes are here. Everything is there. Perfect. Okay. This is the invoice here as per ZRA. If you want, you can print this one. There's nothing, no harm. It's okay. Yeah. So I've shown you everything now here. The next thing I think, um, okay. We can go back to this side. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay and the conclude this thing all i needed to show you is how this thing works this one the super jet why we call it a super jet because of the speed it takes one second to sign an invoice or a maximum of two seconds while crowd it takes a maximum of 25 seconds sometimes it drops it to 13 seconds, okay? We are looking at the maximum, not the minimum. So that's what it is. For now, people, I think let me end there.